All right, Vanessa, thank you. And as Vanessa mentioned, that today is the first day of hurricane season. We are we do want to make sure that your family is prepared. Fair and Salee went to the National Hurricane Center in Miami to hear from Governor Rick Scott and the Department of Homeland Security about what to expect this year. Farron. Yeah, I just stepped back out again right now, and as Vanessa told you, meteorologists are expecting they're forecasting this to be an above normal hurricane season and that's the message that everyone here at the hurricane center wanted to share that's also the reason that state and even federal leaders came to town to share that message as well listen to this also have an evacuation plan so you should know where you're going to go if you're going to evacuate you should have a plan your family members should know where you're going to go if you're planning on going to a friend's house a family house whatever you're going to do Talk about it now. Don't wait until right in the middle, middle of a disaster. The cost of these dangerous storms can be astronomical. Last year, Hurricane Matthew caused $15 billion in damage to the United States, and it barely cracked the top 10 of the costliest hurricanes in history. Now, the Department of Homeland Security Secretary fielded questions also about how the president's spending cuts could impact NOAA and the National Weather Service. He says they'll still both be supported, and based on the forecast, they'll need it. The National Hurricane Center explained that conditions in the Atlantic are more conducive for storms this season. They'll be implementing those new storm surge warnings, which can have an even greater effect on coastal families, and uh, they are expecting to be busy right now. I'm going to continue going back through some of the sound from that news conference so we can share more of that with you as well. I'll have another story ready for you later today at 5 o'clock. Live in Miami, Farron Silly, WPBS 25 News. All right, Farron, thank you. And since it is now hurricane season,